I think it's important to educate as many kids as possible in this part of the world about science and especially girls because we do not have enough scientists who are women. Ever looked through one of these? In parts of Africa, chances are most likely no. This stargazer wanted to change that. My name is Susan Murabana. I'm an astronomer. I think Africa needs more scientists, and especially scientists who stay in the continent, because that way we'll create scientific solutions to our problems. So how do you get more young Africans to be scientists? Get them to become stargazers first. But Houston, we might have a problem. Telescopes are limited in Kenya, very limited in Kenya. So how do you get around that? A traveling telescope. Ah, and who's he? Chu, my husband. He is also an astronomer. The idea um, of the traveling telescope was for us to make it easy for people to look through the telescope by us going to the people. And once it's all packed, Susan and Chu load it up and off they go. It's no easy task, but they've reached 40,000 students in the last three years, like these girls. We do viewings both during the day and at night. When we get to a venue, the kids see us and it's at the telescope. It's like, yeah, it's so nice to see the reaction. The moon looks brighter and bigger because it's closer to us, okay? And that's called a super moon. The main goal of the Traveling Telescope is to get as many young people as possible interested in science. I want to be an engineer. I saw the moon for the first time through a telescope. It's amazing, it's cool. I want to learn more about the moon and I would like to go to space also. It makes me feel really nice to have young people think of science because I feel that science is the way we'll you know, develop and develop in a sustainable way.